Hepatitis is the inflammation of the liver, a vital organ responsible for essential functions such as breaking down fats, purifying blood from harmful substances, and fighting infections. There are many causes of hepatitis. The severity of hepatitis varies, with some forms being mild while others pose serious threats. Viral hepatitis can be either acute, lasting less than six months, or chronic, lasting more than six months. The five known hepatitis viruses are categorized by the letters A through E. Each have distinct characteristics. Greetings, and welcome to Lively Living Tips, your go-to source for daily tips on maintaining a vibrant and healthy lifestyle. Join us on this journey to discover valuable insights that will allow you to sustain a lively living. Hepatitis A is usually spread through the consumption of contaminated food or drinks. Although it is the least risky type which typically resolves on its own and rarely leads to long-term liver inflammation, approximately 20% of cases may require hospitalization. Hepatitis B, which sometimes referred to as yellow jaundice, as it can cause an elevation of bilirubin in the blood, resulting the skin to turn yellow. It spreads from person to person through various means, including sexual contact with someone sick and needle sharing during drug use. The virus can also spread from mothers to their newborn child at birth or soon afterward. Like hepatitis B, hepatitis C is spread through contact with contaminated blood or needles used for drug injection or tattooing. Symptoms may range from none to mild, but in some instances, hepatitis C can lead to cirrhosis a dangerous scarring of the liver. Hepatitis D only occurs in individuals already infected with hepatitis B, exacerbating the severity of the disease. Hepatitis E primarily spreads in regions like Asia, Mexico, and Africa, with few cases appearing in the U.S. due to travel-related exposure. Similar to hepatitis A, transmission often occurs through the ingestion of contaminated food or drinks. The most common types of viral hepatitis are hepatitis A, B, and C. Preventing hepatitis involves adopting various practices to reduce the risk of infection. We have gathered few science-backed lifestyle modification tips for you today that might help you to prevent getting hepatitis. Number one, get vaccinated. Vaccination is a highly effective way to prevent hepatitis. Ensure that you are vaccinated against hepatitis A and B, which are readily available. The hepatitis A vaccine is recommended for those heading to high-risk regions or individuals with specific medical conditions. All babies should get a first dose of the hepatitis B vaccine at birth. Vaccination is recommended for adults who are at high risk for hepatitis, including healthcare professionals and individuals residing with someone diagnosed with hepatitis B, those in the condition of end-stage kidney disease, chronic liver disease, or HIV infection, individuals with multiple sexual partners, and men who engage in homosexual relationships, and people engaged in recreational injectable drug use. It is essential to remember that while there is no vaccine for hepatitis C, prevention is possible through safe practices. Number two, practice safe hygiene. The primary modes of transmission for hepatitis A and E are through contaminated food and water. It is crucial to adopt good hygiene practices to minimize the risk of infection. Always wash your hands thoroughly with soap and water, particularly before dealing with food, using the restroom, and coming into contact with potentially contaminated surfaces. Avoid consuming raw or undercooked shellfish, especially in areas where hepatitis A is prevalent, and make sure to thoroughly wash fruits and vegetables before eating. Number three, practice safe sex. Transmission of hepatitis B and C viruses can occur through sexual contact with an infected partner. Always use protection, especially if you have multiple partners or are uncertain about a partner's risk for hepatitis C. Number four, be cautious with tattoos and piercings. Selecting a reputable and licensed shop is vital for getting a tattoo or body piercing. Properly sterilized equipment plays a crucial role in minimizing the risk of transmitting hepatitis B and C. Confirm that the artist employs disposable needles and follows strict hygiene protocols to safeguard against potential infections. Number five, avoid sharing personal items. Hepatitis B and C can even spread through microgram of infected blood. When we using someone else's razors, toothbrushes, or nail clippers, it may contain tiny speck of blood, which can be unnoticeable. 
To lower the chance of spreading these viruses, it's important to use only your things and not share them with others. Number six, be aware of your partner's health status. Although infections between monogamous couples are rare, they do happen. Know your partner's hepatitis status and consider getting tested together. Number seven, avoid using illicit drugs. Using dirty needles is a common method through which hepatitis C is transmitted. Quitting drug use can be challenging and seeking assistance from a medical professional is advisable if you're facing difficulties on your own. Number eight, maintain travel precautions. If you are traveling to areas where hepatitis is more prevalent, take precautions such as avoiding tap water, practicing safe food handling, and getting vaccinated as recommended. Number nine, get regular screening. It's important to undergo regular testing, especially if you engage in high-risk behaviors or suspect exposure to hepatitis viruses. Detecting hepatitis infection early enables timely medical intervention, improving treatment outcomes, and preventing further spreading. Those at higher risk, like healthcare workers or individuals with multiple sexual partners, should have regular screenings. In conclusion, we can say, preventing hepatitis is possible by following straightforward yet impactful strategies. Getting vaccinated, maintaining good hygiene, practicing safe sexual behaviors, and refraining from sharing personal items are essential measures to protect against hepatitis A, B, C, D, and E. Consistent testing and vigilance during medical procedures add an extra layer of defense. By adopting these preventive steps, individuals can substantially lower their chances of acquiring hepatitis, promoting a healthy liver and overall well-being. So, when was the last time you got tested for hepatitis? Subscribe and stay with us for a continuous stream of expert advice to elevate your daily living and embark on a path to a healthier you.